Hi, Shelly Somak, queen of exquisite style. I am here with the great Mark Astabi, artist of internationally known throughout the microphone. What does this night mean for you? It's a dream come true because I've been coming to this wonderful restaurant called Trattoria dell'Arte uh, since 1992. I have been collected by over 60 museums throughout the world. But there's nothing like seeing my paintings hanging at home. And I say home when I refer to this restaurant because I feel at home here. And so I made that painting there in 1992 called Roman Nose. It's oil on canvas. Shelley recently asked me if I could redecorate the entire main front dining room with paintings of mine dedicated to Italy and my faceless figures. I was so thrilled. I did that painting for the exposure. Now I've had, I've been exposed. When you say exposed, we're just talking about your work, right? Uh, well, I, I, I don't know if you want me to go there, but <laughs> <laughs> I've been exposed in various ways. What has more meaning for you, the art or the music? Equal. I've always been, well, I've been doing both since I was 12. I started drawing first when I was six. And then my mother was a classical piano teacher and she taught me how to play piano at age 12. Oh, how did they work together? Well, sometimes at my art openings, I will also perform uh, a concert. And sometimes at my concerts, I will do like a live painting intervention on stage, uh, which always goes over well, you know, when I stop playing piano and then I'm, maybe the drummer will do a drum solo while I make a giant painting in 15 minutes on stage. And as a visual artist, I've collaborated with musicians also by doing their album covers, the most famous I one. I have heard. Yeah, yeah. yeah most, please share. The, the most famous one is Use Your Illusion 1 and 2 for Guns N' Roses. So Use when it. I want to go to a concert, I, got, I have uh, to well, call it, you. It, it, yeah, <laughs> uh, if you want the backstage press. And, uh, for the Ramones' final album cover, Adios Amigos. So I have two little notches in rock and roll history there. I've done Notch several on those belts. New York and Rome have they're my two favorite cities, and I couldn't say which one I prefer the most. Rome has uh, less hectic lifestyle, quality of life, great food, relaxed atmosphere, great architecture, great art history, uh, and it's just an easy place to be happy. New York has money. You can make money fast and furious. Here. Oh, um, that's our next interview, yeah. how to make money fast and furious. Well, okay. this is the place to be for that. New York, you, it's expensive to live here, but, it, worth it. but it's worth it because you make so much more that you can afford it. How do you compare the Italian food? The Italian food here in uh, Trattoria dell'Arte is just as good as the great Italian food in Italy. And that's Wow, that's hard. high praise. That's hard to pull out because most other restaurants are a, a notch or two below. Because okay. one, what does success mean to you, and how do you achieve it? For me, success is being happy. Okay, I'll tell you how I got happy this morning. Because, um, because. <laughs> okay, that's giving us too much, to, <laughs> too much to leave to the imagination. Realizing that I'm healthy, uh, I don't have to worry about. Uh, where my next meal is coming from because it's coming from Trattoria del Arte. <laughs> it's coming from um, Friendship, art, music, love, the six rules of how to become a rich and famous artist. The rule number one, make great art. Rule number two, live in New York. Rule number three, circulate. Rule number four, be professional. Rule number five, have a story. And rule number six, get other people to work for you. Ah, okay, well, we'll have to have more uh, in-depth information at mm. another time about how you get people to work for you for free. It's really easy to get people to work for you for free. Interns. Well, the first three or four letters were correct. Internet. Ah, interns, love it. Interns are dangerous. Ask Bill Clinton. Oh, by the way, <laughs> I, know, I know them both. <laughs> but, uh, I want more dangerous. stories about that. So now I'll take surveys on... Facebook or internet, and I'll put like 10 paintings and number them. I say, please choose your favorite three out of these 10 paintings. And people respond immediately. So in one hour, I'll get like 100 or 200 responses. So you another way is if you have an art show or an event, get all your friends to come and talk about you. And they're working for free. But it's, <laughs> it's worth it to pay Make sure to too. have a lot of friends. <laughs> it, it helps to have more than one, yeah, for sure.
or at least, you know, fake friends can be useful too. You <laughs> stay so good looking, so you don't eat. So I don't eat, I don't drink, I'm just here to, I'm here for the good friends. Oh, thank you, Shelly. I guess maybe the best thing in the world is, is meeting you, Shelly. Oh. <laughs>